CBS News has confirmed President Trump's son-in-law and senior White House advisor Jared Kushner is under scrutiny in the FBI Russia investigation. The issue is Kushner's meetings during the presidential transition with Russia's U.S. ambassador and a Moscow banker with ties to Russian security. Investigators are seeking evidence of Russian meddling in the 2016 election and possible collusion with the Trump campaign. Jeff Pegues is outside FBI headquarters in Washington. Jeff, good morning. Good morning. Jared Kushner is now under an FBI microscope. He was a key figure during the campaign and during the transition to the White House. Investigators are scrutinizing his actions and interactions with Russian officials and whether they included something improper. After traveling with the president for most of his overseas trip, Mr. Trump's son-in-law, Jared Kushner, returned to the U.S. amid new revelations about the scope of the Russia investigation. CBS News has confirmed that part of the investigation includes scrutinizing Kushner's contacts with Russian officials. Kushner has acknowledged meeting with Russian Ambassador Sergei Kislyak in December. Kislyak then arranged for Kushner to meet with the head of Russian-owned VEB Bank, Sergei Gorkov, who was trained by Russia's Federal Security Service, or FSB. Investigators are looking into the nature of the contacts as part of its ongoing FBI counterintelligence investigation. Kushner's attorney released a statement saying, Mr. Kushner previously volunteered to share with Congress what he knows about these meetings. He will do the same if he is contacted in connection with any other inquiry. Kushner is offered to meet with the Senate Intelligence Committee, which is also conducting a separate investigation. There was no uh, collusion. Since he took office, the president has dismissed the Russia investigation as a scam and a witch hunt. The entire thing has been a witch hunt, and uh, there is no collusion between certainly myself and my campaign. But the FBI investigation continues to expand to include people close to him and connected to his campaign. Also among those under FBI scrutiny, former campaign chairman Paul Manafort former national security advisor Michael Flynn, a campaign foreign policy advisor Carter Page, and President Trump's longtime friend Roger Stone. There has been a flurry of new developments related to the Russia investigation in recent days. A White House official acknowledged that and said that everyone gets their moment in the hot seat and circus. Nora. All right, Jeff, thank you.